All right, welcome back to Spycraft, the great game. Let's play part uh, 10? 10. Last time, we saved the world from nuclear annihilation, which was, was good. Wow, some of the music in this really sounds bad. Seriously, it sounds like like two different songs are playing at once. Are they both trying to play? Wow. Okay. It doesn't sound quite that bad on uh, some of the other sound cards back in the day, but that's that's rugged. At least this song is. Okay. Um, what are we doing? Ah, we're getting a phone call. Harmonica, the alley across from the safe house. Be there in one minute. No tails, no backup. Compromise me and I'm gone. I just might kill you on my way. Okay, well that's exciting. Harmonica's here. Okay, what do you think, guys? Do we tell Harmonic, t tell Max or don't tell Max? There are obviously a few different permutations of this whole scene that can happen. We're going to go with the correct choices for right now, but I will definitely come back and show off some of the other things that can happen here. This is too good to be true. It's being trapped. Stolen. I'll scramble anyone I can find. Nokovsky's losing. He actually cleared you for field work? Glad you can make it, Thorne. What do you want? Prokhat has their eyes on you. Of course, we thought you were harmless. Okay. Now, you're not so harmless. You caught Yank. Pretty soon you can have us all nailed. <laughs> Unless I nail you first. Of course, we could just let the agency do it for us. You're gonna take a major fall back at Langley. They're gonna finger you for the mall. Why? Let's just say you'll soon be filthy rich. Until the agency gets a whiff, that is. Of course, we can hide the scent. If you're a team player. Okay. I'm going to give you a choice. An easy one if you know what's good for you. Join Procat. Or die. God, are those really the only two options? I'd like a... I'd like a third choice. How about this one? Think about it. This is the game. The way it was meant to be. No pencil pushing. No pain in the ass Senate subcommittees. Just action. And plenty of it. More cash than you ever imagined. <laughs> no, fuck off. Nice work. Sorry to you guys about this growl message that I can't click out of. Problem solved. Okay. Alright, so that was Case fun. Case Officer Thorne, welcome to As Intel I said, Link. there's quite a few ways that scene can play out, including um, one of the the only way to get like a truly alternate ending to the game. So, 
we will definitely come back at the end to see all of those options. The guard I had covering Birdsong just turned up dead. His kneecaps were blown off. Rajiv! Now we can't find Birdsong. Whoever pulled the trigger must have him. Okay. So that's what was on our desk when we went in there earlier. This is, I guess, the camera that Frank Malkowski showed off earl earlier. Stores low-res backups on a flash drive, which looks nothing like a flash, flash drive, but whatever. And just plugs into the computer somewhere. There we go. I don't entirely understand what we're staking out here. I get that was Birdsong and he just got like captured, but I don't Where did we send him? What whoa what, what were we doing? I'm not entirely clear on that. Opening email gateway. Rajiv. I don't know where he is. Uh, at London. No. Email canceled. Okay, I don't. Why do we know where he Case is right Officer now? Case Officer Thorne. What? Controlled access authentic. Welcome to the power play compartment access. Linking to Office of Information Resources. Level. Uh, God, there's got to be information on him somewhere. New. New. Uh, there is in Owen Arthur Pearson's 201 file. That's how I can get to it. There has to be a better way to get there, but... 201 files accessed. Oh, Level I can't even routine. get to it from there. Foster, Max... Support personnel. Thank you. Owen Arthur Pearson. Pearson. Operations Owen log. Arth Thank you. <laughs> Why was that in here? I have left a hard copy photograph of him in my file drawer. Click here to access address. Why didn't it just have the address there? Number 19, Leningradsky Prospect. Opening email gateway. Message sent. Good work finding kneecaps. I'll dispatch an assault team ASAP. I want this guy. <laughs> Good. Oh, not this part. Oh, God. Gotta get a refresher on the bad man. This is the bad man. It's a control interface. It's a satellite strike team in interface that lets you control soldiers. It's bad. Developed jointly by US and Israeli spec ops. I doubt this. Da, da, da. Why? None of this makes sense to me. Uh, 
Okay. Get ready for me to lose this. Let's let's drop a save. Bad man. Kneecaps. gives you a top-down view of this building, with a little help from a GPS satellite. Each of us is equipped. Send us a command, we work a special angle. I've got fiber optic viewing. My tool makes an opening, I spy a room from any adjacent wall or door. Sergeant Schiff carries some potent charges, clear passage in the walls. Aguila slices landlines, Washington handles the grenades. I'm running point, Schiff's rear security, but you can change order of movement. Now listen, Thorne, we're counting on you to get us through this without hostile contact. And remember, this is a shadow op. Let's avoid the local authorities. Some of us want to see our families again. Five, four, three, two, one. Execute, execute, execute. Execute. All right, so I'm sure there's people who are good at this. I'm not one of them. So as they said, uh, <coughs> they each have a special skill trying to rescue birdsong and clear the structure as much as we can. There's three floors. I'm not sure if it actually is necessary, but you send a gila to the stairs over here. Slowly. And then he can disable the telephones. I can't see a thing. Over. That's a shame. Thorn, I've got the phone relays. Just say the word. Landlines are neutralized. This will buy us some time. Over. It's unclear if that's actually relevant to anything, but whatever. Now we'll grab all these guys and move upstairs, which is always where Birdsong is. I do not remember where he is or if he's even always in the same room or not. Maybe. I, I don't know. So let's see. Let's use Henderson's fiber ability. No, no, it's not. Maybe. Dude, don't walk in front of the doorway. The These boys are hiding something, Thorne. I don't know what that means, but thank you. The boys are hiding something. Now we can do a motion scan as well. That'll give us an idea of which rooms have people in them. For reasons that I don't understand, if you do a motion scan too many times, the bad guys figure out you're here. I don't know. But we're gonna do it. Whoa! Let's just look her. Yeah, it makes the lights flicker for some reason. I think he's in here. So let's see. I don't remember. So you demolish walls. What do you do? You throw stun grenades. I think we're gonna try this. I think this is a horrible plan, to be honest. But let's go for this. Not that. Demolish 
wall. Will cut over. Fire in the hole. Roger, baby. This room's completely empty. Maybe storage. Over. What? There was movement in here, and they were hiding something like two seconds ago. Okay, whatever. God, that noise is annoying. My grenade wasted birdsong. It's over, Thorn. Okay, well, we know where birdsong is. Oh, this is a fun ending. Thorn, I want you to know I'm violating my own policy by doing this over voicemail. There's no nice way to say it, so I'll just say it. You're off the team. Word just came from Sterling. Frankly, he's not the only one frustrated with your performance. I don't need to tell you what's riding on this. You've jeopardized delicate operations in the lives of many good people. We can't have that. Your lack of performance won't matter where you're headed. I've assigned you as liaison to the CIA's World Factbook. Clear out your office by noon tomorrow and report to the Factbook office by one. That's all. Good. Okay, well, we've learned some important things, like where Birdsong is. I think we're going to do a modified version of that same approach this time. But one that's hopefully less likely oh to God. result in his death. Okay. <coughs> Come on. There we go. I can't see a thing. Over. Why can't I click? Thorn, I've got the phone relays. Just say the word. I'm trying to. But the commands barely work, so. There we go. Landlines are neutralized. This will buy us some time. Over. Okay. You're coming over here. As. Hey, Thorn. Our... What kind of motion we got? Over. I was afraid those scans might tip our hand. Why? That still doesn't make sense. <laughs> These boys are hiding something for I still don't know what that means, but okay. Also, you come over here. You come... Please stop making that sound. You come over here. Fire in the hole. Three, two, one. Oh great, and now there's multiple bad guys. Okay, good. Nope. Okay. I've got it. We did it, Thorn. And I think they're all alive. Wow. That went shockingly well. I told you it was not safe. 
They called me to the meeting, and they knocked me over the head. They never even saw my contact. When I awoke here, they tortured me. They forced me to reveal information about our warheads. Prokhat already stole a bomb. They're mercenaries, people with no conscience. They plan to auction Russia's nuclear arsenal, bomb by bomb. This has been hell. Everyone has betrayed me, and I have betrayed everyone. I am so sorry. Now you must stop these people. I will, Birdsong, I hope. Back to our office. Case Officer Thorne. All right, Mole Murmurs. Hello, David. I found another communication from the Mole. It's a pair of messages. One from Fred Vorbley. The other's from a non-0629, an anonymous remailer in Finland. And whoever they are, they should know how to stay faceless on the deck. Anyway, I tried decoding. No go. Nothing else has paid off. Either. So if you have any ideas on the source. Run it through the cipher tools. Okay. Let's give that a shot. Link established to national security. Okay, so he said he tried the rabbit hound. Let's try the con and I. Decryption no. unsuccessful. Now we could blindly go through all of these books. But let's not. Where did we get the con and I originally? Or the rabbit hound, whatever. We got it from the Electronic Book of the Month Club. Are there any new books on the Electronic Book of the Month Club? Well, there sure is. Croak Goeth the Raven, a neo-gothic horror story set in the South American rainforest. Wow, that sounds bad. How about download the selection right now? All right. Launch cipher tools. Link established to National Security Agency. Decryption successful. I'm blown. Get me out of here or I'll talk. Maxwell. Huh. So the mole thinks we're on to him. That's not what I want. Link established to National Security Agency. Maxwell. Decryption successful. Extraction in three days. Be at location. I will meet you there. Thorn, I'm impressed. I think you've got our mold in a pickle. They used to call me the scout. I might have to pass the baton. You suck, But don't get cocky just yet. That longitude and latitude you decrypt from the mole message? It's Tunisia. Remote Tunisia, near an old training ground for leftist guerrillas. Real pleasure zone. Watch your ass in there. So, the mole needs quote-unquote extraction from Langley, but he can fly to Tunisia on his own? That's, that's not an issue. Getting to Tunisia, a walk in the park. Okay. Alright, well that is end of another episode next time we will go to remote tunisia and i think if that's not the last one the next one will be the last one of the main uh thing and then we'll go back and do some cleanup videos like the interrogation and what happens if you try to join procat this is stefan and scott cheers <laughs>